America, it's time for a gut check. If the Founding Fathers saw us huddled in our little cocoons, texting each other smiley faces, they'd hang their powdered wigs in shame. When our idea of danger is eating gluten, there's trouble afoot. Yes, we the people have gotten soft, and all the likes in the world aren't gonna save us now. But one thing will. Welcome to the place where we speed all day, where we bump and grind in a non-sexual way, where scores are settled and we break the rules, and everybody's got a set of badass tools. Get some NASCAR in your life. Hello, Flurry, goodbye, Sky. Welcome to the place that we call home, where meats are grilled and you can bring your own, where everyone's welcome and we all belong, even my friend and his American flag thong. Get some NASCAR in your life. Hug your kids and kiss your wife. You want Billy and Sally to learn about math and science? Send them to the school of NASCAR. They'll thank you for it. Sure, everybody in NASCAR gets a trophy, as long as they win the race. Did you know that less than 10 miles from Sonoma Raceway, you can go wine tasting? True story. Welcome to the place where your beast is free, like the rubber hooves of a tire stampede, where men and women compete together, just like they did back in the 18 nevers. 200 miles per freaking hour, 700 freaking horse freaking power. Neck and neck, they're battling down this last stretch. Off him and takes Harvick from the checkered flag. There's Harvick, Logano, and Hamlin and Newman. Keselowski, Dale Jr., they're all superhuman. Jeff Gordon, Carl Edwards, Matt Kenseth, the Bushes, and maybe Jimmy Johnson will come back and kick some tuchis. Hello, glory. Goodbye, strife. You've got NASCAR. NASCAR makes its triumphant return to NBC Sports on July 4th weekend.